Looks like you got a spot of shade. Are you Marty Emerald? Yeah. Is that you? Yeah. Whoa! I'm the council person for the area. Uh, with the redevelopment downtown, the gentrification of so many communities, uh, homeless are being uh, forced out and into neighborhoods where they really didn't gather much before. Here in Jeremy Henwood Memorial Park, you can see a symptom of the bigger issue. Uh, we've got people who find a spot of shade and sleep during the day or congregate and socialize. And so we're trying to reach out to them and see if there's some options, some ways that we can get them out of the park and into some kind of a program, but also free up the park for the rest of the community. So this just went up and they'll have three days to get this out of here. But what they'll do is just move it a few feet over and then they, they start the clock all over again. Hey, you got to remember, anywhere in San Diego, there's no illegal lodging, dude, from, uh -huh. from 9 at night until 6 a.m. You know what I mean? When they check, hey, because it was way bad when you used to be downtown San Diego, bro, and you would get a ticket wherever you go and sleep. They need more homeless outreach and they need to come out here and kind of let people know because, like, uh, I believe, like, people give up. Like, they don't have faith and they don't have hope, you know what I mean, because they, they, the way they live their life or something that happened to them that made them end up homeless, and then all of a sudden, bam, you know what I mean? Right now, we're just finalizing a contract with the Alpha Project to bring their crews into District 9, going block by block and into the canyons to make contact with homeless men and women and try to convince them to come in and work with programs, get the help they need so that they don't have to live in canyons or in parks or in doorways. Let's find a way to create a stronger safety net, cast it wide, and keep working on creative solutions with the mind of helping people rebuild their lives and become productive citizens again.